You look like you just seen a corpse. Well, the roads are effed, and something's wrong with the generator. Which generator? All of them. Think it on the internet! Uh, also, there's a dead body under your porch. Holy! Ah! Good morning. That was a clip from the brand new horror comedy, Werewolves Within. The film is based on the popular video game where werewolves attack a small town. I chatted with the film star, Milena Vaintrub, who you might recognize from her AT&T commercials. So just the kind of thing that you're gonna, if you watch it at home, you're gonna feel like you're just gonna really enjoy it. Honestly, that's what I want for people more than anything is I just want them to feel joy. And this movie is that, it's really fun and a little bit scary and a little bit twisted, um, but it's a joy ride. Werewolves Within is a surprisingly well done horror comedy, which will have you laughing and on the edge of your seat at the same time. Wonderfully shot and acted, the film fully delivers on its promise to entertain. Werewolves Within is available on all VOD platforms. It gets an A and is rated R. Premiering on the IMDb channel is the reboot of the popular series Leverage, entitled Leverage Redemption. No, I'm retired. I haven't been on the con for years. We should steal something. We'll do this one, just one. We're gonna go old school. We're gonna have to rob the vault. Yes! The new series takes place eight years after the first series ended, with the team of Robin Hoodlums doing what they do best, taking from the rich and corrupt and returning it to whomever they wronged. I chatted with Kristen Kane and Beth Reesgraf. We get to put these hats back on, and uh, but the most important thing that I found for me was we got to bring the family back together, man. And I was so happy to be with these people who I truly in my heart love. And I know they love me. There's a difference. You can love someone, but to know they love you as well. <laughs> we all came back in. We hugged it out. We got the family back together. And that was the most, that was the most heartwarming thing for me was the fact that I get to work with people that I love. I think it's also going to draw in new people who are looking for connectivity, who are looking for community, who are looking for something really fun, adventurous, uh, heartfelt, and, you know, that they can watch with their whole family and with their friends. And it's truly this show, the biggest response we get is how much it brings people together. Leverage Redemption is a terrific family-friendly con game series offering up the right amounts of drama, tension, and humor and ask the question, how are they going to get away with it? Again, it's available on the IMDB channel or you can download the Electric Now app. It gets an A and is not rated. In theaters and streaming on Disney Plus, Scarlett Johansson stars in Black Widow. We have to go back to where it all started. So they never do that to anyone again. We're a family. We fight with you. Taking place between Marvel's Civil War and Infinity War, Natasha Romanoff must reunite with her long-lost family to recover a drug that will enslave the world or at least that's what I think the movie's about. Between all the fight scenes, Black Widow is a confusing and murky mess with little for the audience to grab onto, and worse, underutilizing Scarlett Johansson's character. The only shining light in the film is Florence Pugh as Elena, who overcomes the film's lackluster story. In the end, Black Widow needed to be deeper, crisper, and more fulfilling instead of just another generic superhero film. It's available in theaters and on Disney+. Plus. It gets a C and is rated PG-13. For ABC4, I'm film critic Tony Toscano.